Hey everyone, thank you so much for coming to my channel, D vs. Debt. This is Denise, and I am here with a ton of happy mail. So you all filled my mailbox with Valentine's cards, and it's not even January yet, so I am beyond thrilled. I wanted to do a video just about that because I have half a dozen cards and a gift here to share with you. So thank you so much to everyone that's showing me some Valentine's Day card love. So let's go ahead and get this party started. The very first one is so adorable. I felt really bad because I forgot to mention a few things when I talked about my Valentine exchange. So one of the things I forgot to mention is if you want me to put your picture up on the screen, please let me know your channel name or your Instagram handle so that I can so I can find you. That sounds kind of threatening. So <laughs> so I can look you up <laughs> and show your picture. On my channel so the first one unfortunately I wasn't able to find on Instagram or on YouTube so I really apologize so this card is from Mary Jo and it made me gasp three times so I took it out of the envelope and I was just like oh this is the cutest so as a certified cupcake holic I was just like oh my gosh this is the cutest little Valentine ever so I was shook about that but wait, there's more. Inside the card is an old timey Valentine, like the antique style. And I was just like, oh my gosh. So this is just the cutest thing that I've ever seen. Oh my gosh. And this is my Valentine. Though you wake or sleep, my heart is yours and yours for keeps. I mean, oh, how cute is that? So I love that. But wait. There's more. <laughs> so the third gasp came in the form of a debug. So thank you so much, Mary Jo. This is amazing. The next card is from Zara at Z Bling Creations. Look how cute this is. So the heart is foiled and I just love the typewriter. I want to get a keyboard for my computer with the typewriter keys, but they're so dang pricey. But this came with something cool inside too. So I'm shook with these little gifts that everybody's including. Look how stinking cute that is. Little bunny with a chocolate, a delicious bread, which I'm a big fan of. And how cute is this? So I'm wondering though, is this like tattoos for paper basically? Cause the texture is like, it feels like those tattoos that you, you know, wet and put on your skin. These are so cute. The funny thing about the bunny is I just got in from walking my corgi and she's got big old ears. Some lady stopped her car. She was driving down the street and she's like, hey, I thought you were walking a rabbit. <laughs> so I thought that was cute. Cause usually anytime I'm out walking her, people stop and like, corgi, you know, that's what I hear from everybody. So it's a first that somebody mistook her for a rabbit. So gorgeous card, really cute stickers. Thank you so much, Sada. And speaking of dogs, this is just so stinking adorable. So it says, I'll chew on a bone, a ball, or a shoe. But for Valentine's Day, I choose you. So how cute is that? Any guesses about who would send a hilarious Valentine card? Who is it that makes everybody laugh? And her note was really sweet. Oh my goodness. So I covered it up to protect her privacy, you know, because that's a private message. But any guesses? So it was Chris from Budgeting Just Because. She is so funny and I love this. I'm a proud dog mama, so this is just so perfect. Thank you, Chris. This next card is from Candy Hughes and sticking to the dog theme, my favorite dog growing up, the sweetest dog ever, she literally lived up to her name, was Candy. And so I just love that connection right there. So Candy sent this really sweet card that says Valentine's Day comes each year to remind us there's so much in the world to love. How beautiful is that sentiment? And the card itself with a heart-shaped earth, oh my gosh, this is so fantastic. But wait, there's more. <laughs> Can you guess what it is? My goodness. So not only did it rain, Valentine's cards, it also rained D-Bucks. So wow, Candy, thank you so much. I was so excited about that. Grinning ear to ear like a fool. And this last one was an important reminder that I had also forgotten to talk about. If you don't observe the holiday, 
you can send me you know whatever kind of card you want and then i'll send you one back so remember anyone who sends me a card gets a card back as well as one of the cash envelopes that i made cash not included obviously i just like you to see what it looks like with money inside the vellum kind of makes it you know like a frosted effect but on the back it's perfectly clear so this is just to give you an idea that this and a card is going to come to you so i love this oh so much because if you know me you know the fact that i am a crazy plant lady i live in a jungle basically in my house because i have so many plants and then i like to get all mad scientist on them and chop them and propagate them and have more plants so <laughs> so this is so perfect so it says oh hello there so love 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 super super cute and this is from jess at courageous money and so she wrote something really sweet in here that's going to give away but wait there's more <laughs> it's going to give away the fact that because of my channel she started looking for in this case a debug for me hooray but she's also looking for them with in the letters of her family members so i just love that i think that's just the coolest thing ever that we're out here hunting for letters that hold special meaning to us so thank you so much for thinking of me and sending me a debug that really made my day and your gorgeous little card made my day these plants right here the string of pearls i tried to grow them that's one of the plants that i failed miserably at I learned that string of anything like hearts and bananas and all that i'm not good at the only thing so far i haven't killed is a string of pickles so i'm very proud of that plant but i love the card i love the fact that you gave me a debuck and i love that you're out here hunting for dollars with the letters of your family members names on them so yay made me so happy and then last but certainly not least oh my goodness there was an Amazon package waiting for me in my P.O. box and I was just blown away. So this is from Johanna from JoJo's Debt Free Journey and she sent me a sweet little note talking about the fact that she loves bingo and that she wanted me to use these for the bingo challenge. That made my day that's oh so thoughtful and amazing. Let me show you one of the daubers. that cracked me up. So look how amazing this is. She loves bingo as well, which I totally do. I actually miss the fact that there was a church here in town that used to have bingo night and it was amazing. I would look forward to it. I would recruit people to go to it with me. They had what I called bingo burgers, which were the tastiest burgers ever. And they were so cheap, that's why I love them. <laughs> but it was just so much fun. But there was a group of ladies that I would be so jealous of. We would secretly call them the bingo mafia. And so they had, you know, like their whole group going, they would dress up, they had the coolest bingo daubers, they had like bingo bags and just, you know, they were all official. And so I was like, man, I want to be in the bingo mafia when I grow up. So, <laughs> so this made me think of that. But I love the fact, like these are all amazing colors. I love the fact, because here's another thing about me. I am a Bob Ross freak, basically. I'm like his number one fan. So look at the name of the brown dauber. It's burnt umber. So that makes me think of like one of his paints in his palette. So that just made me smile. So I'm gonna be looking for excuses to use that brown dot marker. And here it is. So because she got me these specifically for my bingo savings challenge, I'm gonna go ahead and redo my sheet since I only have three that I stamped in so far. So now I'll be able to boom, smack these with an actual bingo stamper i'm gonna match them up so the b is gonna be the pinkish color so right here the i is gonna be my favorite burnt umber my bob ross tribute right there <laughs> n is gonna be like the tealish greenish color g is gonna be the blue and o is gonna be the purple so i have matching colors for every letter so for each row it's gonna have its color and that just makes me so dang excited like silly excited about this and i'm gonna find excuses for sure to use the other daubers as well and i'm actually gonna start looking for places to go play bingo around here i think there's one 30 miles away that i might just show up and like usual i'll be the only one that doesn't have you know a full head of silver hair but johanna thank you so very much that was incredibly kind of you to send me that completely made my day and I'm so thrilled to start using this. So thank you for thinking of me. Thank you for spoiling me rotten with your sweet gift. 
and yay, I can't wait to start using these. So that was it for today. Thank you so much to everyone who sent a card, showed me some love. I'll be putting your Valentine's cards in your cash envelope in the mail on Monday. And so keep your eyes peeled for that. For anyone else who wants to participate in the Valentine card exchange, my PO box address is in the description box down below. So just click expand and you'll see the details there. But thank you everyone for watching. Hope you have a wonderful day.